Well, welcome back to Factorio uh, C Block with TSM goodness in there as well. Um, okay, so the only thing I've really done since last time, so I can have a bit of a look at it, is add one more inserter here. That's just enough to keep this one going more or less continuously, not quite actually. Um, more or less continuously. Um, and there doesn't seem to be a hold up here. Um, this can obviously handle more of these. Um, we are going to have a problem when these jam up, which they're going to do uh, sooner or later. Um, probably what I need to do, there's not a lot of point to this one being here. I might just move it um, out. So it's up here as well. Uh, we need some more landfill at the back here. Uh, another stretch of pipe. Power. Uh, a bit more landfill. Another machine, uh, still more inserters, did I leave inserters behind? Yes, I did. So another inserter, this one is more of that stuff and actually we need this to go out all the way to, well not all the way to there, but it's going to go out to there now because <laughs> That's just the way it is. Um, and one more of these so that we can... We will get rid of these at some point in the near future. Uh, just not quite yet. Uh, you need to reach out to there. Um, oh. There we go. So uh, let's just sort out a few more things now. Um, we don't need this to go up there. We can have it come down to there. Um, I think one of the texts that we have recently, and in fact we're almost out of text, let's add the few remaining ones that we haven't done yet. We will need this military tech at some point, so it is worth doing. Um, it's just, it's not high priority when we're not obviously fighting directly with fighters. Oh good, there's some more down here, but it was behind um, some of these others, like radar, armor, agricultural planning. Okay, so there's a, there's a few more texts that we can do. Um, I think we did warehousing in the brief moments I was having a quick look earlier. Um, yes, which at the very least would give us a silo, I believe. Uh, but of course, I don't know where to find these things. <coughs> um, there it is. 50 steel plate, good grief. Um, and we don't have a silo. Uh, we might even have the 50 steel plate, you know? No, we don't quite. How much copper do we have? See, the copper's definitely building up. Um, I might even grab what we've got. And put well, at least half directly into there. Just to get this process underway again. Uh, you are going to get jammed very soon. What have we got? Four steel, 34. Well, I was going to put a uh, warehouse out here and dump all of the excess brown algae into it, but uh, maybe there's no space for that. Um, I think this episode is going to be washing because having a look at the tech, if you have a look at this, we need um, the two items sort of up here. <laughs> being tin and lead, I think they are, tin and lead. 
Uh, that uses tin plate, and we also use micro circuits, uh, which uses micro wafer, which uses oh, it uses a wafer stamp. It's just iron plate. That's fine, and uh, lead plate. So we need lead and we need tin. Um, so let's have a quick look at what's required for lead and tin. Tin plate um, comes from crushed bobmonium. Well, there's no crushed bobmonium around. Do we have any other options? Tin ore, molten tin, no. So we're going to have to fake to get some bobmonium ore from the looks of things. We can get that from mineral sludge, um, which we can get from a charcoal filter, slag slurry, and purified water. Now I know I'm pretty sure we can make these um, charcoal and a filter frame. Um, the recipe for the filter frame—that's not the one. It's just iron. So the filter frame is not a problem. Uh, we're making charcoal, so we can do this one. The slag slurry, okay, purified water is one of the things that right at the beginning of the game, we were throwing away from one process. Uh, we're not actually doing that process anymore, are we? That's making saline water. That's one of the things I find a bit amusing. I mean, all this, this looks like ocean to me. It doesn't it doesn't look like a little lake, so why is the water not saline to start with? Never mind, that's the way it is. Um, so, filter water. Um, yes, we were throwing it away. So we know in a hydro plant you can make purified water. Um, and something else that we were using to make, we do not need to make more brown algae though, not at the moment. So we could reverse what we're doing with the hydro plant to give us the um, whatever it was we were looking at tin, crushed bobmonium, mineral sludge, slag, slurry. Well, that also comes off slag as a possibility. Or crushed stone. Basically, we're going to need to get sulfuric acid. Okay, that's problematic. Uh, purified water we can make from an odd mix of hydrogen and oxygen. Or we can make it directly from water, which is what I was thinking of. Or sulfuric wastewater, but I don't know where we'd get the sulfuric. Oh, we get it from here. So there's a possibility if we can get this started, we can get the sulfuric acid uh, to happen. Um, to give us the slag slurry. Uh, we know how to make slag, although we're using every bit that... I oh know, we actually have a little bit backed up here, and we could add more machines here. So that would be quite good. Um, or we could even set up a completely separate um, operation of it. Oh, that's not so good. Uh, do you have any excess in there? Yes, you do. Okay. You should be good for a while. 180. Yes, that's an issue. Let's take those. And you're up to 12 again. And you made only 16. Doesn't make that many, does it? Um, so, still looking at tin. Crushed bobmonium, we need the mineral sludge. Uh, what other recipes that we have? We didn't have any. Oh, it's just a different filter. Yeah, no. We only our only option is this one. So slag slurry, which we have. We can either use the crushed stone, which we need to. Uh, expand our area, or we can use slag. That's it. Okay. So that's how we do the slag slurry. And we know how to do the purified water. So that will give us sulfuric waste water. And you lose the charcoal and get a filter frame back. 
um, slag processing. So that's what we will have to do. Um, I don't quite know how we're going to get the sulfuric acid in the first place. Uh, that's not an option, that's not an option. So we have to somehow get sulfur dioxide gas. That one doesn't look like an option. Lead ore and oxygen. Well, we, we know we're going to need lead, so... Crushed rubite. Crushed rubite. Rubite ore also comes from mineral sludge. Okay, so how exactly do you get the slag slurry to start this process? We don't have sulfuric acid. Sulfur dioxide gas. I don't know how we get that. Uh, what was our first option? Sulfur. Hydrogen sulfide gas. Sulfuric wastewater, that's fine. Sodium sulfate, which we can't do yet. Alright. Uh, hydrogen sulfide gas. Aha! Uh -huh. Mud water. We can get it from mud water. Hydrogen sulfide gas. And we get that from mud, which we get from viscous mud water. Oh, it's just a cycle. Um, washing. Liquefier, really? Made in a liquefier, that doesn't make sense. Um, that's a liquefier. Uh, okay, liquefier, liquefier. See, I think we need this seafloor pump. And washing plants, that's what I thought we needed to do. What about... Um, we need to try and make so anyway. We need some. We need a bit of land. Uh, I'm just going to uh, run along here. There's bound to be a ton in here, another 800. Not exactly running short. Okay, so it says we can do this in a liquefier. I have my doubts. Uh, none of those are liquefiers. It won't be in those. Is that a liquefier? Crystallizer, sorter, warehouse. Liquefier. Um, okay, so liquefier. Something's going to have to come into this liquefier. Slag slurry. Mineralized water. Viscous mud water. That's probably what we need. So we need mud. Did FNEI tell us where mud was coming from? Mud, that's the mud. From a washing plant, I think is the answer. Um, so let's build a washing plant. I'm pretty sure we need it. Uh, stone brick, we're out of stone bricks again. 
we've got tons in there. Let's build a washing plant. I think we're going to need one of these. Uh, washing plant, washing plant. Okay. Uh, let's put that there. And we have a seafloor sea floor pump. Um, which then means we can get... Uh, is it heavy mud water? We don't want clay. Heavy mud water. Viscous mud water. Heavy mud water. Um, I'm assuming that's what comes in here, is it? Maybe not. That's just normal water that goes in there. Uh, okay, let's move the over one. Heavy mud water. Uh, let's get a normal offshore pump then. I'm not at all familiar with this recipe. Okay. So you will make me... Um, that's the water coming in. Where are we getting the viscous mud water from? We need this thing. But that needs mud. And then it makes the mud water. But we don't actually have the mud to start with. There must be another way of making mud. Heavy mud water. Uh, I don't know what these underground pumps, um, seafloor pumps pump. Let's get another washing machine. Maybe I can. Uh, where was it again? Washing, washing. Uh, high water treatment, that's it. Too close. That one. Heavy mud water. No, that needs... Oh no, that has... Ah, I get it now. We don't need this thing. Um, this pumps in normal water. This one pumps in the sea... The, that stuff. So the best place for this is basically a corner um where we can have it like so choose this recipe um and then we can put in uh, that pump that's our water and the heavy floor that's that water and this will get us this stuff which I don't know what to do with, and this stuff, which is the super valuable stuff. So we need some sort of tank now. Um, there's got to be tanks in here somewhere. No, that's, a, that's not a tank. Small storage tank. Inline tank. Small storage tank, small inline storage tank. Uh, I should turn Discord off, shouldn't I? Petrocam, small inline tank. 
Uh, oh, there you go. Volume 20k, 2.5k, 2.5k. This one's 20k. Steel, stone brick, iron pipe. We can probably cope with 2.5. This is 2.5k. Why wouldn't I just use this one? Um, and what are we going to do with the stuff that comes out this end? Which must be the heavy mud water, is it? What's the usage? Make more mud. That's all we can do with it at the moment, is make more mud. Uh, let's just put it into a tank for now. Um, okay. How are we doing? We have 70 hydrogen sulfide gas. And the heavy mud water is full. Okay, um, we have our hydrogen sulfide, we wanted sulfuric acid. Uh, let's go. Uh, that's right, they like spelling it with an F, don't they? Sulfuric acid. Sulfur dioxide gas. What do we use? Hydrogen sulfide. Let's do it that way. Hydrogen sulfide. Hydrogen sulfide. Hydrogen sulfide and oxygen make sulfur. Is three sulfur enough to make sulfuric acid? You get 60 sulfur dioxide gas, so I think the answer is yes. Okay, um, hum hum. Uh, so, in other words, we do this in a chemical plant. I think it's worth using the angel machines because otherwise we have to use the level 2 machine here, whereas the level 1 is pretty quick um, and the normal chemical plant. So. One of these things should be offering chemical plants. There it is right there. And we can just execute that. Um, I'm just going to pop up here, grab some more of these, and maybe drop a few more of those in there just to keep that moving since we seem to need them. Um, so we have a chemical plant. Uh, you are going to make sulfur. Oh, sulfuric acid, really. Only if you get sulfur dioxide and purified water. So it looks like I'm going to need another chemical plant. That's kind of obvious straight up. Uh, actually, you're going to do that. You are going to make sulfur dioxide. 
gas, sulfur dioxide gas. No, we actually need you to make sulfur. Calcium chloride. Uh, sulfur. And of course, these don't line up to where I had them. Right, turn that around. Um, so we need purified water. It's just as well we made this machine earlier. Uh, maybe I can put it over here and then we can share. Well, too much, for, too bad for sharing. Not that good at it, I guess. Um, and what you can do is water purification. Uh, we'll have to use another pump because I cleverly used my only pump on the uh, over here. Um, and let's get some power. Oops, don't go there. Go, oh, maybe I'm going to have to go there. So I think this is the purified water. So that goes there. We need a clarifier. To get rid of the saline solution at this point. Um, and you need sulfur dioxide. No, you need sulfur. What do you need? Sulfur dioxide gas. And you are making sulfur. Um, hydrogen. I know we've got hydrogen gas. It would be a shame to not kind of use it really. Um, stone pipe. I might have to make some iron pipe. So that should now have made some sulfur. Um, you need the sulfur dioxide gas. So sulfur dioxide gas. I'm betting needs another chem plant. Uh, duh, duh, duh. oxygen as well. Um, could put it somewhere like that. You could make sulfur dioxide. This is very messy. This, oh my goodness. Um, tech. Uh, okay, radars, uh, heavy armor, Agricultural planning, fluid burner, weapons, and weapons. 
I don't think there's any other red. Oh no, I oh, don't know. That's only at the very end that you can really be bothered trying to do that. Um, so you need sulfur and you need oxygen. We've already got oxygen coming down. So all we need to do is break off a supply. Um, and I'll have to come down to there. This is some of the messiest spaghetti I've ever made, but um, it will do what we need it to. Stone pipe. Oh, I've been using stone pipes. Okay. Um, and we need some more of these guys. Um, like so. Okay. So now we have sulfuric acid. Great. Um, just a moment. Okay. Um, so... Uh, we have sulfuric acid coming out of here. Uh, we needed that for something. Hopefully we're making enough. I don't actually really know anymore. Um, we'll have to tidy this up again later. Uh, tin. That we don't have. We don't have. Mineral sludge is what we're trying to get to. Uh, slag slurry. So we need slag. Um, which is basically one of these machines. Um, an electrolyzer. One or more of these machines, should I say. Um, what we might do is... Uh, Fill in that little hole. Get this out of here. Uh, electrolyzers. Uh, are they here? Electrolyzer. Um, we need more stone bricks. So the very thing that we had there. Uh, do I have any more stone? No, you do not have any more stone. All right, let's set this recipe again to the um, stone making. I can find it. There we go. Stone making. Um, and we will put on a furnace temporarily just out of the way here uh, with a little bit of fuel. Um, and now let's grab some of those stones. need her electrolyzer even in the right place no electrolyzer no 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 filtration crystallizer electrolyzer we need 10 per I probably want a couple of them how many of these we got that's pretty good um, electrolyzer one two Oh, we haven't to craft those things. That's not good. Uh, electrolyzers. Okay, so... Um, let's jump water like so. Make some more pipe, stone pipe, iron pipe. It's easy to easier to make iron pipe. Um, and then we wouldn't have to have done such a swirly mess as this. But um, never mind. Okay, what we'll do then is. Get some more of those happening. Uh, that's stone. Let's get some of those. Um, 
gets rid of that one. Um, where does this go? It doesn't appear to actually go anywhere anymore. So I guess what we will do is just connect up to that and use the same flare stack for both products. Uh, so you should be making slag, you are making slag. And we'll pick up from there, and you from there as well. Actually I could um, put one on one side, one on the other side I suppose, but uh, slag into what? Uh, mineral sludge, uh, slag slurry. We need a liquefier for this operation. A liquefier, okay. Uh, that may have been in here. Crystallizer, filtration. Uh, this one, a liquefier. Liquefier, liquefier, liquefier. Um, Filtration crystallizer. Been there. Uh, liquefier. Oh, what are we missing? Stone again. Okay, you can go back to um, sand. Uh, how many do we need for liquefier? Ten. Liquefier. sure where I want this. You're going to make slag slurry. Did I read the requirement correctly? Slag slurry is made in a liquefier. Slag slurry, right. Um, so the sulfuric acid that we spent all this time making can we get through from here to to there? Yes we can, good. go straight down to there and we want some of this Slag slurry. That's one product. Now, what else do we need in this uh, conundrum? Slag slurry. Uh, next up, um, purified water. We're making purified water down here. Okay. What I'll do is I will get myself some more, some more land. I uh, probably don't need that much, but.
we have it now. Um, so let's use iron. Purified water, slag, um, whatever it is. Now, slag, slurry. Uh, this is made in a filtration unit. Right, I remember seeing that somewhere. Not there. Filtration unit. Uh, not there either. Filtration unit. Need more stone brick. Uh, filtration unit. Not enough ingredients. We don't have enough um, circuits. Where did they end up? Oh, we need more copper. We have more copper. Copper. that will do for now I hope filtration unit yes um, okay so the filtration unit uh, can go up here and you are going to make slurry coal filtering because that's all that you can do And that is the first bit of good luck we've had in a while. Because um, that can just go straight up there. This one can go in like so. And we need an assembly machine. Oh, we already had one. We need an assembly machine uh, to make the filters, which will be probably under one of these. There we go. Filter frame, charcoal filter. All right, well, we need to make some filter frames first, which is just iron and iron sticks. Um, I don't think you lose the filters. So this needs to be charcoal, and we'll have to direct some charcoal down here somehow. Um, we'll find a way. And um, we need to use this. Um, I don't think I need very many of these things. So what I might just do is, um, how many does it make? It doesn't say. That does five at a time. So we need at least five. Shall we get like 10 iron sticks? Something like that. Iron sticks. Which I would have thought was in here, but it's not. It's in there. Iron stick. Uh, and the recipe, you get, so five pieces of iron. Uh, we need power down here. Excellent. Whoops, we actually need that down. Um, you can now make those frames. Um, you can have all of those, and you need some more iron. I'm fairly sure we'll have a lot of iron sitting in here. Um, how much iron do you need? You need probably like five pieces. Five frames, and you just now need charcoal. I'll leave that there just in case. Um, we want to run a belt, probably. Um, where is the charcoal? It's up here. 
Let's just jump one and then use a splitter, which we can't do because we actually need copper cable. That's an odd one. I would have thought it would have needed that rather than copper cable. But no, it needs copper cable. Okay. Uh, we can make them now. Uh, okay, you go in here. Spaghetti-o. Okay. Um, in there, in there. And this gives us slag slurry. Um, two empties, which go this way. Um, that's the one we actually want. This one needs to be reprocessed back into sulfuric acid. Um, but, well, should we take the positive side first? So the tin, we now have our slag slurry. Uh, we have that purified water is this one. If we have another filtration unit, no. We have our mineral sludge. No, that's not what I wanted to do. We have our mineral sludge. So now we can make bobmonium or if we put it into a crystallizer. So that's what we need, a crystallizer. Crystallizer. We need basic electronic circuits. Crystallizer. Where are you, crystallizer? Um, you're kind of in a bad place there. Pipe. Um, Bobmonium ore. Looks like we can get rubite as well, but let's get bobmonium for the moment. Um, bobmonium ore. Oops. Can go to crushed bobmonium directly to tin, but look how inefficient that is. Or. Uh, oops. Um, or you can get crushed bobmonium, which you can then sort, and you get four gives you two, plus it also gives you silicon ore. Um, now I'm not sure if silicon ore is on. Whoops, is on our list of what we need here. Wafer stamp, no. Um, that needs lead plate. So it doesn't need silicon, so that one doesn't actually help us that much. Um, but I know you'll need silicon later on. Um, guys, I think we're actually going to have to call it here and resume this um, spaghetti mess uh, the next time. But I think we've made progress. Um, the first thing is just to get it up and running. The second is when we will try and deliver some better quality than this uh, mess to the whole operation. Oh, you actually need some power as well. Uh, that's not quite what we want or had in mind. Um, you go in there. How about I actually prioritize, output priority that way, yes. You go this way first, thanks. Um, yes, so we're slowly coming along. Um, we'll get this uh, tin and, and lead sorted in the next few episodes. 
and uh, move on to green science. Until then, thanks for joining me, and I look forward to seeing you in the next. Bye-bye for now.